Knock, knock, knock. Come in. Hi, Mr. Peterson. My name is Corey, and I'm going to be your student nurse today. Can you tell me your name and birthday? Kevin Peterson, 9371. Okay, perfect. So today I am here to give you a heparin injection, okay? Okay. Since you're going to be in the hospital for a few days, we're going to do this heparin every day so that it will prevent the clotting that could occur from you not moving around like you normally do on a daily basis. Okay. okay? So heparin is, it, it helps with blood clots and um, it goes into your abdomen. And one of the things that can happen is you can have bruising from the injections. So that is a normal side effect. If you were to experience nausea, vomiting, uh, chest pains, or pain in your arm, your jaw, or your neck, those are things that you need to let me know about right away, okay? Okay. Because those are adverse effects. So, but the bruising that you may see, that's that's normal. Okay. So, okay. Do you have any questions for me before we get started? No. Nope. Okay. All right. So, with the heparin, I'm going to give you 1,000 units. Now, this... Um, file here contains 10,000 units in 10 milliliters of fluid. But because I'm only going to give you 1,000 units, I'm going to give you one milliliter of the medication, okay? Okay. So uh, before I get started here, I'm going to provide for privacy. I'm going to uh, wash my hands. I'm going to put my gloves on. Have you ever had a heparin injection before? I haven't. Okay. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is put my needle together. Um, this is a little tricky with my gloves so big. Okay, here we go. So this part right here goes on the tip of my needle, just like this. Okay. Now I'm going to remove this cap and I'm going to put one milliliter of heparin in this syringe. There we go. Okay. And now using my bottle here, I'm going to put cap back on it. That normally would not happen. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean the area from the inside out, making sure that there's no dirt or anything like that on the area. Okay. So um, I'm looking for any kind of lesions or any kind of skin discoloration. I don't want to put a heparin injection in where one has already been, so I'm also looking for bruises. So I will, this site looks good right here. So I'm going to go right here and I'm going to go from the inside out, making sure it's all clean. Okay. Now I will remove my cap and I'm going to go bubble up. I'm going to pinch the skin and I'm going to go at a 45 to a 90 degree angle. When I do this, it's going to go in quick. And then I will put this in slowly, releasing the skin. You doing okay? Uh-huh. Perfect. Then I will let that sit in there for 10 seconds. And I will remove my needle. I will dispose of it in my sharps container. And then I will take my two by two here. I'm going to place it over where I gave it. And I'm not going to uh, massage or pat the area at all. Okay, there's no blood there, so you should be okay. So if you do have any of those side effects that we talked about, you be sure to let me know right away, okay? All right. Do you have any questions? I don't. Okay, so I'm going to remove my gloves. I'm going to dispose of them. And then I will perform hand hygiene. Here is your call light. And you let me know if you have any questions, okay? All right, thank you. You're welcome, thank you.